No, Dad, no, just no. Okay, you know Alice, right? Alice Carpenter? So you do remember her. Dad, I dated her for 12 months, 29 days, 6 hours, and 12 minutes. I think I know her. All right, all right. Well, she died. It, you know, it seems just like yesterday that we were talking and laughing. Oh my god, Dad, I told you not to talk to her! Oh, sorry. Well, she was the vice columnist in my newspaper. Wait, she's Dear Alice? I sent all our relationship problems to her. I even used her full name. Twice! Well, that sucks. Anyways, I need you to take over for her. You want me to be Dear Alice? That's no big deal. Dad, I'm not gonna be Dear Alice. I'll pay you. Ingum. Dad, you really need to stop watching so much television. Okay. Mom. But you're gonna have to do it or else you're grounded. Come on! Gil, listen to this. All these problems suck. Dear Alice, my mailman is so hot, but I'm just too shy to talk to him. What do I do? Here's an idea. Grow a pair. Now listen to this one. Dear Alice, my fiancé won't move in. How do I ask him? Once again, grow a pair. I feel like all these people's problems can be solved by simply growing a big pair of... Hey Alice, more mail. <laughs> you're Alice? Yeah, I'm Alice. <laughs> That's a, you're a dude. Alice yeah, I know. Like girls I know, I know. <laughs> Sitting here in this office, but my heart is nowhere near. I'd rather be in traffic court or anywhere but here. This job is not for me, it's just totally not for me. Problems are just weird. Dear Alice, a bee just flew up my butt. Should I call a doctor? Oh, probably. Dear Alice, I can't believe it's not cream cheese. Me neither. Dear Alice, I'm not sure, but I think my dog might be a drug addict. Maybe you shouldn't have the drugs in the house in the first place. Dear Alice, I was petting my gerbil when diarrhea just shot out everywhere, like on the curtains and on the floor. It made it into rooms that didn't even have a clear opening. That's not even logical. How does that even happen? This is the worst one. Dear Alice, I got out of the shower yesterday and my dog saw me naked. Things have been awkward ever since. Should I confront him about it? I, it, it doesn't, like... You just gotta talk it out, man. I mean, that happened to me once and we just talked it out and it, things will work itself out. Dude, are you actually getting into this right now? Do you want to be Dear Alice? Because you can do it if you want. You need to chillax. This job is stressing out too much. You know what you need to help you unwind? A little... But in all seriousness, dude, we need to get me fired. You could... Eat the food that's in his fridge or push his best friend off a bridge. Spread and facts, not pay the tax, but in his drink, puke in his sink. Take his money every dime or show his wife a real good time. Dude, that's my mom. Oh, right, sorry. <laughs> we need to get going, this job is such a bore. We need to get going, can't be Alice no more. Take a break and don't come back, say his wife's got a real nice rack. Hey! Of ribs. Smack him right across the face or put it right in his briefcase. Fill his cars with tons of flies or kick him right between the thighs. Post something on the internet about that weird guy and his pet. Wait, what did you just say? Kick him right between the thighs? No, before that. Fill his car with tons of flies? No, after that. Post something on the internet? Yes. That's perfect. So when your dad finds that video, you're definitely gonna get fired. So what are you gonna do with your last day as Alice? I think I'm just gonna mess with people. Like how? Well, listen to this. 
Dear Alice, my boyfriend broke up with me, but I don't think he meant it. Should I still try? Listen to this. Dear Jenna, I too have had this happen to me, and I just wanted to let you know that there are three easy steps for fixing this relationship. One, hit the gym as often as possible and lift a lot of weights because guys love when their girlfriend is stronger than them. Two, completely stop talking to all your girlfriends and only talk to your guy friends. And if you flirt with them, bonus points. And the last step, stop shaving all together. Men love a hairy lady. Hope this helps, Alex. These are the people that are writing to me. They think that it's Alice, but it's me, can't you see? I didn't really care that Jenny got dumped, but I think you should know that your dad was quite pumped. And Martin, I'm sorry that your cat passed away, but honestly, man, no one cares anyway. These are the people that are writing to me. They think that it's Alice, but it's out, can't you see? Lindo, really? You like a cute boy? Well, so does, uh, in the closet, Joe Roy. Kathy, I know, you're scared you're knocked up. You won't tell your parents, so I did. What's up? Sorry to be harsh, but you're all such a bore. But do me a favor, don't write Alice no more. Have a seat, son. What is this? You're gonna have to be more specific. You post people's private letters to you on the interweb. Letters that they entrusted specifically to you. You know how much liability this puts on me? You are fired! Fired! Hey, hey! How's it going? What's Crack a lacking, uh, homie. Damn it. I'm you're trying, to be, you're trying to be cool. I'm in gum, pilgrim. Try it again. Yeah, how yeah, you doing, man? I, I wasn't recording, so go. All right. <laughs> something, 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 something. What's this? Sounds like Bert getting Roy Bridge. <laughs> what was he doing before? It hurts so good. Okay. Dad. We're so gay. No, it's Woo! it's not. Rosie held that up! Ah!